Hi, welcome to the Dakota Prairie Museum's Facebook page. And my name is Laura, the curator of exhibits. And we're talking a little bit about L. Frank Baum and his Wizard of Oz books. A lot of people know that Baum lived in Aberdeen once upon a time, but they don't really know much about the time that he spent here. It was actually quite important to his career and to Aberdeen. Baum was born in New York um, in 1854, and he, as a young man, he had a number of jobs. He was a traveling salesman, he was a newspaper man. Um, he worked in various stores, and when finally came to Aberdeen in 1888 with his family, the year before statehood, he decided to open his own little business which was called Baum's Bazaar. And it had every manner of thing right on Main Street, Aberdeen. All kinds of imported fine china and beautiful furniture and toys and candy and books and fresh flowers, which was unheard of in Aberdeen at the time. Well, unfortunately, in the 1890s in Aberdeen, there was a great drought and a lot of people had to sell their homesteads and their farms and leave, go back where they came from. And all the stores suffered and Baum's, little Baum's Bazaar did have to close. His second job was to buy a newspaper and once he changed the name, he became the editor and part of the writing staff. And it was called the Aberdeen Saturday Evening um, Newspaper. He wrote an article, which was probably the most important and entertaining for the local citizens part of the newspaper. And it was called Our Landlady. He wrote that article as if he were an older lady who managed a boarding house in Aberdeen. And as she made notes about humanity in general and Aberdeen constituents in particular, and there were a lot of great stories about all the important people in Aberdeen, um, lightly disguised, and Aberdonians loved it. Unfortunately, the newspaper also went bankrupt um, another victim mostly of the drought at the time and Baum moved his young family to Chicago. But later he began to write the Wizard of Oz series of books of which these are four and there are a total of 12 in the original series. And many of the characters and many of the plots were things that were influenced by his years in Aberdeen. So when the museum reopens, please come and enjoy our new exhibit, L. Frank Baum and the Wizard of Oz.